grandfather worked in the shipyard and his father, before him, my great grandfather that is, was working as a rigger and a foreman was castigating the men for taking too long to do a job. Mm -hmm. And my great grandfather apparently said to him, the job has to be done properly. If we don't tension the rigging correctly, then the mast is likely to fail, particularly if there's strain on the derricks. We have to do the job properly. Mm -hmm. And it takes time to get the tension just right. And of course the foreman's attitude was, you need to get on to the next job. You're taking too long, just get the so-and-so job done. Mm -hmm. And my great-grandfather was actually quite a devout man. He was quite religion, mm -hmm. religious. And he quietly suggested that he really didn't need to use foul language. And the foreman turned on him and started poking the chest, I'll use any kind of language I like. And as he started doing that, that just triggered an explosion. And my great-grandfather just lifted his fist and right up an uppercut under the chin and stretched him out in the deck of the ship. And after that, he was never a problem. Mm -hmm. And he kept a civil tongue in his head. And I remember my uncle telling me, he said, I said, my father was here. And he said, <laughs> he couldn't believe it because he was a very gentle man. Yeah. He was religious and never raised his voice in anger. And then all of a sudden, this guy ooh, started prodding in the chest and the fist came up and laid him low. Thank you.